A lot of people told me crime doesn't pay. Me being me, I didn't believe them. I thought I'd get a few quick quid for a few quick jobs. What I didn't count on was lying face first in my own blood on my first gig. I said we would. Oh, you yeah, little faith, eh? <laughs> Let's have a look then. Oh, bloody hell. It's got to be half a million at least. Oh, really? Yeah, sure. Oh, wait, what's that all about then? It's a little bit of Sydney VAT, sunshine. So this is Sydney. He's a friend of a friend. He's the one who introduced me to this crime lark in the first place. He's got an act for it, or so he says. Anyways, I'm the one who got us this job in the first place, right? I think you'll find it was me. What took you two? It was Tommy here. A few dummy nights shy of all means, this one, eh? Oh, shut it. Hand it over. All of it. Anything you need, boss. Sydney's got it covered, right? I'm not fat Tommy, here. Oh, Give on. us your phone. What for, boss? I want to phone my boss. Tell him what a lovely job you both done. Well, give him it, Tommy. It's a short phone number. Speed down, you mug. <laughs> I like to report two bodies in an alleyway off Whitechapel. <laughs> oh, shit! shit! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay. Can we just talk about this? Just, just talk to me. My, my. What am I going to do with you? Two bodies were found with gunshot wounds off Whitechapel Road. They had been identified as Sidney Pearson from Essex, who has a history of low-level crime. The other body has been identified as Detective Bill Johnson. Police believe that he was killed in the line of duty while attempting to apprehend Mr. Pearson. Investigations are currently underway to ascertain if there was a third shooter involved. So the moral of the story is, crime really does pay. But in the end, Oh, f***.